the, the top of it's based on the bandstand, the old bandstand out there, the gazebo type bandstand, the beautiful old thing. Um, you have that with a bunch of musical instruments coming out of it, and pedals, the poodle, uh, a giant sized pedal is the poodle over there. Uh, and around the bottom, there's going to be more <laughs> classified. That's right, people have to come and see, right? That's right. What's the hardest thing about working with Sam like this? It's probably the first day, which is uh, all physical labor, shoveling all this sand up. That's, that's probably the hardest part. Typically on a job like this, we would use a, a tractor, you know, front end loader, bring the sand in and actually lift it up and drop it into our farm work. But in this case, we use uh, wheelbarrows and a crew of guys that wheelbarrowed 25 tons of sand in here in two hours. Fastest I've ever seen sand moved by hand in my life. Very impressive. What happens is the sand is uh, then put in a formwork in six to eight inch layers, and we use construction compactors to compact it, uh, lots of water, and the formwork is, is filled from top to bottom in six inch layers. And uh, once the whole thing's full, we climb up to the top, we break off the top form, and it reveals a block of very dense sand and we start sculpting and removing forms as we work our way back down to the ground. This is the uh, logo for the event, the uh, International Cherry Blossom Festival logo. And uh, like you had said, this is one of the more tedious things you can do. How long do you think this is going to take? Well, I'm here until Sunday, so no matter what.